personal experience that they can touch you. Now, oh, bro, my door gets kicked in if I, if I say what I'm thinking. You know there's going to be people who believe you're just saying this because you've, I don't know, had a mental breakdown or taken drugs and you're repeating of course, some of, of the course. things you said on the internet. Of course they're going to want that. And I have all the information about the right time I'm going to release all of it. But they're already calling me to tell me to stop. I don't give a fuck, dude. They can't stop me because they listen to the devil. I listen to God. God gave me authority. It's over for everybody, bro. I'm trying to expose everybody. Brian, to be, to be honest with you, I believe that she's not your best interest at heart. Okay, I get, I get that, but I don't care. At the end of the day, I'm trying to really stop every fucking devil worshiping bitch. Bro, I don't. We giving all praises to you all by Shimia Shai, man. So we're gonna start at the top, Luke chapter twelve, verse one. Was two years old, they were on, um, on TikTok. Now, hey, you know, psychological operations, control opposition, we know all these things. But you keep, you got to remember, we are in the last days. And how Shai clearly said, you know what? I'm going to go straight to it. Luke chapter 12, verse 2. For there is nothing covered that shall not be revealed. Not a hit that shall not be known. So, yeah, man, we've been speaking on these things, you know what I'm saying, for quite some time. I want to give it away. You already know that it's all good. Now, the Heavenly Father is allowing these things to come to the forefront, to the public eye, like you know, like no other, because there shall be no excuses. Now, you could be control opposition, control opposition, psychological operation, but ultimately, Yahweh by Shimei was shy and it's prophecy. Being fulfilled. I don't give a fuck, bro. They held me down and they made me watch little kids get. I don't give a fuck anymore. They fucking took me to the fucking woods, bro, and they fucking tied. I'm not fucking joking, bro. I have fucking proof, bro. I don't give a fuck. Bro, I fucking will show you every fucking video you could ever fucking believe. Bohemian Grove is real. They fucking tied me down and they made me fucking watch, dog. I absolutely don't give a fuck anymore. I don't give a fuck, bro. They me. I was two years old. They me. Yes, I fucking lost it. They're little kids. Because they want to take us all, so let's go. You hear that, man? We've been telling you, you know what I'm saying? Visualize for quite some time, but one of the elect will take heat. So now the Heavenly Fall is allowing different platforms and different individuals to bring this stuff out, man. This is a very, very serious ordeal we're dealing with. We are in a war. The children that, that mainly get put into these types of um, trauma is mainly Israelite children. But, you know, you got other nations are involved as well. They're their children. But the, the main ones that's being raped and tortured, brutalized, are Israelite children man male and female so what he said you got tied down had to watch children get raped he also said, He's giving all praises to you all by shimmy i was shy man so we're gonna start at the top luke chapter 12 verse 1 it says god knows and cares so so this is all prophecy being fulfilled because we at the end of an age, man. The end of the so-called white man's rulership. And that's how he gets down his wickedness. Murdering children and raping children. Uh, human trafficking. That's that's Satanism, man. Okay, so the Lord is going to stop all this. Right? By exposing him. By, by the elect of the nation of Israel being awakened. The tabernacle... The tabernacle, the tabernacle of the Most High is with men, first and foremost. Women, you want to sit the fuck down, you're going to shut up. And that's, that's what's coming. You understand? So the Spirit is on him to say that, man, because you got to remember the Most High is the Father of Spirits, man. You understand what I'm saying? He'll use anybody he wants to to bring out some truth I rock the ass back to sleep. Who knows what might happen next week with this guy? My CMT, like everything is okay. I don't give a fuck. We, we, we've been telling you. These things are real. So we're going to start at the top. It says, in the meantime, when they were gathered together an innumerable multitude of people, insomuch so much that they trolled one upon another, he began to say unto his disciples, 
First of all, beware of the leaven of the Pharisees, which is hypocrisy. So the Pharisees back then were wicked Israelites that was coming against the Mosai only begotten son. Okay? Those were <laughs> those were some wicked Negroes right back then. The leaven, leaven, when you go into the word leaven there, it's the same thing that's going on again today. You're dealing with some wicked ass Israelites with leaven in their doctrine. Okay, little leaven, leaven the whole lump. All right, the numeral multitude. Where is it at? Beware of the leaven of the pro, uh, of the Pharisees. This is metaphorically speaking of the inveterate mental and moral corruption. Dealing with the same thing going on again today with the doctrine. There was some moral corruption dealing with the name of the Most High, saying the name is Jesus the Christ, which is thoroughly incorrect. Viewed in its tendency to affect, to infect others. So you liken unto when you, you know, have a dough and you have leaven in it, it will affect that whole bread. All right, it says leaven is, a, is applied to that substance which is small in quantity, yet thoroughly pervades a thing, but it influence. The New Testament uses it in both a positive or negative sense, a little leaven, the leaven of the whole lump. So these same type of spirits are out here, in the nation of Israel as well, teaching some truth mingled with, mingle with um, hypocrisy. There is nothing covered that shall not be revealed. But there is nothing covered that shall not be revealed, neither hid that shall not be known. So the scripture says it's hard for a rich man to enter the kingdom, but who knows what the Lord is doing? But we know for a fact this is what's going on. The Heavenly Father is revealing these things. All right, you go to the uh, precept, the precept that pops up here. This is a beautiful priest of Ecclesiastes 12 and 14. For God shall bring every work, every work into judgment with every secret thing, whether it be good or whether it be evil. So the spirit he's in, he don't give a fuck, you know? So peep this. All right. Matthew chapter 10, verse 24. Uh, I'm going to start at verse uh, 26. Fear them not, therefore, but there is nothing covered that shall not be revealed and hid that shall not be known. So that's the spirit he's in. That's the spirit we're in, period. Like, we don't give a fuck, bro. Shit. We we, we, we yearning for the Lord to destroy this evil-ass kingdom. <laughs> so you satanic bitches. <laughs> Shit, yeah, bro. Yeah, the whole world lying in darkness. This is the valley of the shadow of death where you're supposed to fear this thing. So you got to be ready to die, man. Valley of the, let me type in the shadow of death. And this is not the end all be all, you know. This is most sides bringing judgment to pass. It was Psalms, the 23rd chapter. Yeah, man, duh. It's Lockyer. Psalms 23 and 4. It says, man, so we got to read this whole thing, man. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. All right? All caps L-O-R-D is Yahweh in the Hebrew. And he guides you through his only begotten son, because that's who's really in charge, and the holy angels dealing with your mind and everything that's around you on the physical plane. And ultimately, he comes in the volume of, the, of this book, the scriptures, he making me to lie down in green pastures, leading me besides the still water, which is this truth. All right, we're likened unto sheep as well, and you, once you, the sheep are grazing, are grazing in green pastures, you get fulfilled. The still water, you know, this is this is this is nourishment for you. He restored my soul, which is this word that restores you, not money, fame, and all that. So to make it a society, you got to be exposed to that type of shit, man. And, and Jay can't handle it. <laughs> but hey, he's a good boxer, so we'll see what happens. You know, he 
restored my soul. He led me in the path of righteousness for his name's sake. For his name's sake. Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shai. Or Yahweh Wa Yahweh Shai. Yea, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, this is where we at. Job 9 and 24, we are surrounded by death on all sides, man. Okay? Only a few souls out here the Lord is going to uh, rescue and deliver upon his second coming of who the world ignorantly called Jesus Christ, whose real name in the Hebrew is Yahweh Shah. So if you really believe, man, all that is going to, you're going to, the Lord is going to try you. It's hard for a rich man to enter in. But the Lord uses whoever he, want, he wants and does whatever he wants, man. And we can box and skills from, from the lineage of Jacob. Right? All the tribes, man, we are warriors by, by you know, by heart. Okay? So the Lord is exposing all these things. I care about you a lot, and I can assure you from my own personal experience that they can touch you. Now, oh, bro, my door gets kicked in if I, if I say what I'm thinking. You know, there's going to be people who believe you're just saying this because you've, I don't know, had a mental breakdown or taken drugs and you're repeating of course, some of, of the course. things you've said on the internet. Of course they're going to want that. And I have all the information about the right time I'm going to release all of it. But they're already calling me to tell me to stop. I don't give a fuck. Dude. They listen to the devil. I listen to God. God gave me authority. It's over for everybody, bro. What are you doing? I'm trying to expose everybody. To be, to be honest with you, I believe that she's not your best interest at heart. Okay, I get, I get that, but I don't care. At the end of the day, I'm trying to really stop every fucking devil worshiping bitch. Bro, I don't. Shoo wee! Giving all praises to y'all by Shimmy. I was shy, man.